Hi guys, I thought I'd share a quick video on how to open HEIC files in Windows 10. It is native now in Windows 10 but you need to make sure that you have the codec installed and can open it correctly and then you shall have no issues opening the file. It's worth keeping because you notice that the file size of my image is only 700 and 97 kilobytes. Generally this file would have been 1.5 meg. So as you take your photos it is much nicer to have everything reduced in size and still keep the same quality if not better with HEIC. So I thought I'll show you how to open them up in Windows 10. Okay so if we open up this file you'll see that it doesn't work. We download the codec from the Microsoft Store Okay, so now we have to do, you notice that, see, it wants to install the media extensions, but it says you own HIF extensions, so all we need to do is hit install. We don't need to buy the media extensions below. And we are done. Okay, so all we need to do is click out. Now if you notice, if we try opening up the file, it still doesn't work. So you see, even after it's installed, we can't open the file. And it thinks the codecs aren't installed. But if you right click, generally you're meant to go in here and say change and choose Windows Viewer, but it's not present. So, let's install the software that I spoke about earlier on, the free version, how to convert. Okay, so we hit download, we run, Yes. Next, I accept. I confirm it's for personal use. Install. Okay, we're done. So now if we right click this, you can see the option to do the convert, which converts the file straight away. Okay. There's a picture of me in a bodysuit, haha. <laughs> okay, so now if you still open it up, you notice that it can't open it still. But you notice how I had a new option to open it up now in Windows Photo Viewer. So all we need to do is go to Properties, Change, Open in Windows Photo Viewer. That's by default, hit OK. Now if we open up the HLC file, we're done. And you can see the file. And that's it. So now from now on Windows 10 here, we'll be able to open up HEIC files and that will include any other files. The only issues you will have, of course, is Photoshop will not recognize these files unless they are a newer version, which should be in the future. Otherwise, you can do my tips before on how to convert to JPEG and also change your iPhone not to do it again. Okay.